hello everyone it's me asmr welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorials and today i will show you how to edit this type of photo and this type of outdoor type photography and i'll make a preset in front of you and i'll provide you that preset download link in my video description so hope that all are in a safe place and at home don't go outside stay at home and uh, work from the home let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first control or command j for the new copy of this layer or you can drag it and drop over here you will get another copy of this layer and then go to the filter and then go to the camera filter in the camera filter i will change up the color calibration and i will make it like this and the green color green saturation i will make it down and blue i will make it like that that's good and then in the fx options i will add some Postcrop vignetting like this a little bit minus 5 or 4 is good for this no lens correction issues and split toning I'll change up the split toning suppose like that uh, that's good and it could be like this that's good and I could have to change this one again because of uh, I'll change up the vibrance from here and the temperature from here and highlight i'll make it down the highlight and add some dehaze option that's good and from the rgb tone curve i'll make it down and make it like that that's good and now i'll have to change the split toning split toning highlight color and shadow color it make the split toning that means you are splitting the tone to separate the tone of your photographs so like that or i can change the shadow color so when you are changing the hue you will get the different types of color just because of hue is the color palette you can choose color from there and now again tone curve i'm going to the blue tone curve and i'll make it like this and that's good and the red tone curve I'll make the red tone curve like this and then the green tone curve and amount of sharpening and luminance of noise reduction and other stuffs will be like that that's good and from here add some texture and that's good the saturation of the green i'll make it down purple and the aqua and yellow as well so here orange and the red that's good and green i'll make it like this so luminance of the red and orange i'll make it up from the main panel i'll de-highlight these things add some contrast a little bit desaturate a little bit and now i'll change again the split toning yeah that's fine and i'll change up the color you can choose the color from here yeah that's fine and from here add some little bit vibrance it will make sense and the saturation of the red and orange i'll make it like that and the hue of the red i'll make it like yellow like orange type and this one as well and green i'll make the green like this so let's see before one and after one before and after and then i'll add some like clarity i'll make it down a little bit that's good from the tone curve i'll go to the rgb tone curve again and locked up over here from here i'll change up the color that's good suggestion like that before and after i'm saving these settings and giving the name outdoor so giving the name and i have another two photos i'll select those photos and apply this preset to them controller command j make copy filter camera filter and go to the load settings options 
I'll find out that preset which I made it a little bit earlier like this that's good and you can change and you can you don't have to change it anymore and hit ok and then another photo let's open it up this photo actually let's control or command J go to the filter camera filter and then go to the load settings options from here outdoor yeah you are getting this type of effects and hit ok and this preset you can also use in the lightroom let's go to the lightroom so from this panel from this panel i'll drag and drop these three photo in my lightroom so dragging and dropping those things in the library so it will take time yeah fine and now i'll select only three photos and import that things yeah import of the photo is done now i'll import the xmp file which i made it for you guys go to the import preset this portion and i'll go to my drive here outdoor and import it out it will import now i will apply that thing so where is the outdoor let's check it out or let's find it out here you are getting the outdoor and just apply this one and you can sync all the things so select these three things by pressing shift and hold it and sync that things and synchronize and you'll get same tone in other photos like that so here this photo this photo and this photo you're getting same things or same preset press the shift and hold it and select three photos now i will export those things go to the file and export and after that select a folder uh, i'll select this folder choose and other setup is fine and all the thing is good and now export it out it will give you the final output here the exporting one photo number two and number three these three photo i got export of that so you are getting the result or final output like that the before image was like that and after one you are getting like that before and after so hope that you learn a lot from this video and this preset will make your photography editing level in the next and if you want to get the download link please check out my video description and stay at home work from the home and uh, don't go outside maintain all the safety precaution from who and stay alive from the covid 19 keep me in your prayers as well guys until the next video i am asmr signing out today bye bye